I am just giving you a quick update about the MRI test scan that I supposed to be doing today. I just want to inform you that everything has been really complicated as I already expected. Since last week, I have been trying to get a MRI test done from actually three different hospitals now. But today, I have finally managed to get some sort of prescription to do it. And even so, with that prescription, I went to the next door place where they do the MRI test, which is for urgent cases. But uh, she said that I don't have a prescription for that place, which is actually within the Charité Centrale, which makes the whole situation not logic and complicated and extremely confusing. Even today to find that place where I had a meeting today with a doctor was extremely difficult. I had to go to four different places and speak with around 10 people to get through the place where I actually had a meeting. So I don't really understand the logic behind such a bureaucratic system when one is just trying to get a name my eye test just to prove and show that I have been under a sonic attack here in Berlin. It's very important that I've been doing everything what I can, giving the information that they are giving me and following every single step of the way in order to get the MRI test done. However, it, it is has been challenging because whoever they are, or even if the system is always like that, the possibility of me getting the test the schedule is still very, very limited. Even though I have a prescription now to get it done, I cannot do it in the Charité Centrale Hospital, in actually, in fact, in any of them, because they are not classifying the exam of the prescription as an urgent matter, which once again is really intriguing to know that um, I've been under a sonic attack and they are not classifying this as an urgent matter. Obviously, within the next few days, there will be less evidence of a sonic attack. For that matter, whoever did that to me will get away with the crime because basically I cannot get my brain scanned. And the brain scan is so important. And in fact, it was so important to get it done last week, not even within the next few weeks, right? In my view, this is definitely an urgent matter because a foreign national person, myself, has been under a sonic attack, which is a criminal offense. So I should have been sent to the MII test immediately and urgently to deal with the matter. But of course, I know this is not going to be easy and I'm fighting a lot of injustice and that's one more injustice and bureaucracy and not logical system that I have to fight every single day since I moved to Germany. But as you know, I am a warrior and I'm not going to give up. And I'm going to have this MRI test done regardless if it's going to be too late or not. But I have to do it because I believe and I'm 100% sure that I have been a victim of a sonic attack here in Berlin in Germany. Yes, you heard me. German people were never gonna accept or believe in my words, but I'm not here trying to convince anyone. I have evidence, and I know they are trying to make my life more difficult than already is. And in fact, they will do whatever they can to cause me harm. This is evident. So I am here calling off this video saying that I still have not been able to do a MRI test, which is once again extremely suspicious and once again is more evidence they are not taking my case seriously in fact they are questioning my sanity and they are trying to divert the entire case into a psychotic event 
In fact, I told the doctor that there has been no psychotic event since the 28th of December until up to today. I am confident that I've been under a sonic attack in Berlin, and it is evident. And my words speak for themselves. And I do believe that has happened. And I do believe there are forces here in this country. As we know, the Nazis are just sleeping and waiting for any giving opportunity to do such a harm in people like myself, black foreigner from this privileged background. Yeah, of course, I am one of the uh, primary target. As you can see on the website, I'm fighting for a lot of social and human rights. And it's, of course, I'm going to be one of their first enemies. Of course, I will. I already have enough evidence that things that they tried to do with me and, you know, things from removing my name from the briefcase to removing my name from the register office without my consent, which was in fact illegal, damaged my properties, stalking on me constantly. I've been already stopped by the police nine times within the last year. And there are so many more facts and evidence and videos and reports and everything what I've documented. That itself is a huge evidence case that I have against the system. And obviously, they will try to slow me down, stop me or cause me harm. But I will fight back for justice and I will not going to give up. And now I know their only mission is just to, you know, try to make me sound a little bit crazy. But let's really play with that and let's see how far that goes. I am confident that I will find justice and that everything's going to be all right because, as you know, no justice, no peace. Follow, like, and share for amazing political content.